I'm Tim Bartz, the e-commerce director at Long MacArthur Ford in Salina, Kansas. In this video, we're going to present to you the new 2015 Ford Focus. And we're going to go over the what's standard on all your S Focuses. So uh, every Focus that it comes with, we're going to go over the standard equipment, as well as tell you just a few optional equipment that's available on the S. And if you are interested in the SE or the Titanium, uh, do check for the links uh, down below. We are going to have links to those videos as well. Uh, but this will just cover the S model. There's a lot of things that are standard. Uh, I think you'll really enjoy it. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, the starting with the outside of the vehicle. Of course, it starts with a 2.0 four-cylinder engine. It is a variable cam timing engine. Uh, really nice. Uh, that along with your five-speed manual transmission that's standard on the S model, I uh, get you about 26 miles per gallon in the city, 36 on the highway, and that's estimated by the uh, um, what Ford has on their on their window stickers and such. Uh, you, know, you can get an optional automatic six-speed automatic transmission and that, that is available as well. So you can always look to get that. So you can get an S with an automatic. So it does also have uh, electronic uh, power assist steering. We call it E-Pass. Uh, what's great about that is it kind of helps with fuel economy. So instead of being gas uh, powered, it is electronic uh, powered so that it takes a the load from the battery, not your gas, so that's great. Um, but also it helps you when you're driving, whether it be on the highway or in a parking lot, it's gonna, gonna help you, so it's gonna assist, assist you in that steering. So really the benefit to that is if you're in a parking lot uh, and you need to turn you know, tight but slow, it's gonna help you with that. It's gonna be a little bit easier to turn, but on the highway it's gonna tighten it up and make it stiff so when you're driving along and that Kansas wind comes from the side, it's not gonna affect you as much because it's not gonna, it's gonna kind of turn as much. So it's a great feature there. Another safety feature that you have on the vehicle under the hood here is an advanced track with electronic stability control. Uh, what we like to say here is it keeps you on your intended path. So when you're driving on those slick uh, days, it's raining, snowy, that kind of thing, it's using the brakes and the, uh, the, the engine to go ahead and help you stay on your intended path. So um, a lot of things going on there that just makes things go real fast and it's just faster than we could do ourselves. So uh, it's a great system, love advanced track. Now start here at the front of the vehicle. Um, of course, you do have the body colored, in this case, white uh, bumpers all the way around. Uh, what's really ni nice about that, it really dresses it up. I uh, do have a little bit of black here uh, on the bottom part of the bumpers, as you can see there. So that kind of differentiates that from the S, from the SE, and the titanium as we, as we go further on on those videos. Also, your grill is your black painted grill with a chrome surround. So I like, even on the S model, you have a little bit of chrome to kind of dress it up a little bit from the front. Uh, of course, I love that new, uh, the front end, um, kind of updated it, and a lot of the vehicles have that same design. Your headlights there are quad beam, halogen headlights. So it's really nice about that. It's gonna light up the road. Nice big headlights, so you're gonna be able to see in front of you. Uh, gives you great visibility in the evening and those nighttime, so. Looking at your wheels, the S does come with steel wheels and does have the nice silver painted uh, wheel covers there, so that's really nice. Kind of gives it that dress from a distance. Can't really tell, it almost looks like an alloy wheel. On uh, the tires, it uh, does have tire monitoring system, which is really great about that. It's monitoring those all the four tires. If they get start getting low, it's, what's going to be great about that is it alerts you with a little uh, light on your dash that so knows to go to your nearest Ford dealer and go ahead and have those checked out. So. Also, going forward, you do have your power mirror here. It's uh, black painted here on the outside, and it's that, that flat black, and then it's got your power mirror glass with the blind spot mirrors. What I love about that is you're gonna be able to see that person that's in your blind spot nice uh, and easily, so that way you, you're just a nice safety feature when you're on the highway or even driving in the city. You do have uh, black door handles, and as we go further in the SC, you're gonna notice those will change to body colored um, but on the S, you do have the black, um, so it differentiates that model. Coming around to the back of the vehicle, really nice feature, standard on all the focuses. This is an S, standard on all of them, is your rear backup camera. The camera's right there on the, the hood, or on this case, the, uh, the tailgate. So it's really nice as you're gonna be able to see behind you, so that way you don't back up in anything. Uh, just a real nice safety feature, and I think in 2017 it's required in all new vehicles, so that's really nice. We already took care of that on the Focus. Does have rear defrost, of course comes in handy. Most vehicles do have rear defrost, but uh, just wanna let you know that really helps to clear off the uh, glass uh, for any kind of frost and such. And of course, lastly, going around the vehicle on the outside, it does have easy fuel capless filler, standard on all focuses. 
What's real nice about that is you don't have a gas cap to, to fiddle with. Leave them behind, get your hands dirty. You can just open the door, fill it up, and close it when you're done. Uh, it's great, nice seals on it, so you don't have to worry about it leaking or anything else like that. So it's a really nice system that Ford's had out for several years, and it works really well. That covers the exterior. Now we're going to go ahead and uh, jump on the inside and go over the interior features. Okay, moving to the interior, one of the things that's the, probably the biggest thing is safety. When we talk, think about safety on the Focus, we think about the, all the airbags this has on it. Starting with the front here, dual stage front airbags for the driver and front passenger. Also, we have a driver knee airbag that'll protect the driver from that steering wheel column, uh, which is a really nice feature. Also gonna have airbags on both the front seats and that'll protect you from the side, uh, tor torso of the front uh, driver and front passenger. And then of course up here, you're gonna have your side uh, canopy airbag. So that's really gonna come down and protect you from the glass from the side. So you're really surrounded in a pillow, um, really protects you. And uh, we've had a lot of these come in with really bad collisions and uh, people have come across just walking away with no injuries. So they're very protective. Um, it's just, they just do everything right to keep you safe. So of course, the S model does have power windows, uh, which really nice power windows for the front two windows. So that's a really nice feature. Also does have power locks, so that's uh, real nice as well. The lock controls are just in the front seat, uh, the front of them, but it does unlock all the doors, so that's a really nice feature. Um, moving here to the steering wheel, you're gonna have tilt and telescopic steering wheel, which is really nice. Uh, what makes it real nice and easy for this vehicle to fit all different size drivers, as you can see, I can, if I have someone that's a little bit, has bigger legs or something, it can be moved up and also be somebody shorter can move closer to you or even further away so it's a really nice feature to be able to fit any size driver uh, no matter how tall or short you are so that's a real nice feature um, moving along we do have sync with Microsoft uh, technology uh, real nice you have the hands-free with your you can go Bluetooth uh, your phone in it's going to go hands-free you can just use the button and use all those voice commands to make your calls receive calls uh, that's a real nice feature there for you to stay hands-free um, of course, moving along, you do have your manual climate control, as you can see here. Real nice and easy to use. Real, as you can see, it's real close, just at arm's length. Uh, and then, of course, you do have your AM, FM, CD with MP3. Real nice feature. Four speakers in, in the vehicle. And as we move along to the SC and such, you'll see uh, more speakers and you'll see uh, some other features that go along with the radio. So, uh, But a really nice system. Now, your, your uh, backup camera does show up right here on this screen. Um, as you back up, it's gonna show up uh, right there, so that way you can see how close and far you are from someone. Now, keep in mind, it's not a um, reverse sensing system, so it won't beep at you and let you know when you're getting closer to something. It's just gonna be that camera. So, that uh, pretty much covers the interior uh, of the vehicle. Uh, so that covers the S model. So hopefully this uh, really kinda helps you get an idea of what's standard on an S, and maybe that's enough equipment that you're looking for. Uh, all those start like around that 15, 16 uh, price range, I believe, for us right now. I think that's our internet price on a lot of those. I think um, MSRP is around 18 for those, so that keeps that price down. Uh, now, if you go up to an SE or a Titanium and you're interested in a little more equipment, check out the SE and Titanium videos. They should be showing up uh, below. Um, of course, those are available, so that way you can see what else you get when you go on up to those models. So thanks for watching this video, and hope this gave you a and great information for you on that Focus S.